The villagers are dipping their torches in kerosene and heating up a vat of tar. Not so fast. Time for Saints football. It's time to talk Saints football with the one and only Stephen Wiley. Ugly. That's all I can say. It was ugly. Hi, I'm Steve Wiley. Welcome to 70 Seconds of Saints. Um, It was hard sitting in the Superdome last Sunday afternoon, but I'm going to tell you something. I didn't bail at halftime. I didn't bail at the end of the third quarter. I had to drive back to Lafayette, too. I waited till there was about four minutes left in the game. (sighs) Two-time NFL MVP, four-time Super Bowl MVT, MVP, excuse me. Tom Brady just flat torched us. That's all there is to it. Okay, that's it. We're not going to discuss that any further. Moving on. Okay. Carolina Panthers coming up this Sunday. Another previous NFL MVP quarterback in Cam Newton. The Saints look like a team in disarray. And, you know, Sam behind the camera and I were talking a few minutes ago. Uh, Sean Payton, Mickey Loomis, um, who that nation's calling for their heads, at least in social media. And I, I'm puzzled. I don't understand this at all. These are the same guys who put together a Super Bowl championship team just a few years ago. Yes, it was seven years ago. That's forever in the NFL. But in the grand scheme of things, it's not. They've missed on some draft picks. Uh, Brandon Cooks was a first-round uh, draft pick. Of course, they traded him and got a first-round draft pick in exchange. Ryan Ramchick, who uh, shows a lot of promise. Stephon Anthony. They chose him in the first round two years ago. He led the league in tackles, or the team, rather, in tackles. Um, but the rap on him was he had trouble diagnosing plays, and he just didn't seem to be learning, or at least that's the report we get. We don't know. We don't see these guys in practice. So a former first-round draft pick has been traded for a fifth-round pick to the Miami Dolphins. You scratching your head? Yeah, me too. I don't know. I just don't know what to say. I don't know what to think. And we got a tough opponent, tough divisional opponent coming up. And and before we, we cut, they have gotten off to an 0-2 start before and made the playoffs. All right, we'll be right back. And now it's time for Steve Wiley's Pick of the Week. All right, during that quick little break, I was informed that Cam Newton is actually questionable for the game. Now, I got to believe that if the guy can stand up, He's going to walk onto the field. (sighs) People have been saying the Saints offense has been too conservative. Why aren't they throwing the ball downfield? Well, you you can't protect the quarterback. You can't do that. So what's going to happen Sunday? I got to, I got to shoot you straight. I'm not optimistic. (gasps) I can't sit here with a straight face and predict the Saints are going to win on Sunday. I'm sorry. But don't give up the ship. There's still a long way to go. I'm Steve Wiley. Thank you for joining us for 70 Seconds of Saints. 